Okay, I'm going to print my own um, permanent vinyl. So I just go to Google. Uh, nothing big. It's not like for a customer or anything or not for sale. So I want to find an image that's not watermarked. And I want to find one that is... I'm going to pick a couple of them because sometimes even if it's a background it could still become distorted when you uh, spread it across the paper so let's see I'll go with this one let me pick one more just in case Okay, let's just go to Word because I just use Word. I don't use anything major. So I'm going to click up here and I'm going to insert the image. And let's just go with this last one. And let's see how it will work. So even with those images. Okay, so I ended up going with this one. Like I said, sometimes you have to play with it um, in order to get the right fix where it won't be so distorted. So I'm going to print and I'm going to send it to my uh, Epson 2850 and I'll meet you at the printer. Okay, there's two sides. There's the Cricut side. And there is the print side and so it gives you instructions on the print and cut I'm not I'm not going to print and cut I just done it you know with word which works um, the same so I'll put it in with the printable side up. okay there's two sides there's the Cricut side and there is the print side I'm going to come over here and click print As you can see, Okay, so in terms of Cricut, I want to get like bulky letters or more of a block style letter so that my print will show. Okay, so I'm going to use this type of text and I'm going to put in Casino. And I'm going to duplicate and bring it up just a tad bit. These are going to be for the base, um, the centerpiece. I can bring it up just a tad bit more. Let's see. But I measured it at 20. So I'll go down just a little bit. Okay. And I'm going to come over here. I think my print should be dry just enough. And I don't need to mirror because it is um, permanent vinyl. Continue down here and let it go and find my cricket. Okay, so when you print, you want to come up here and browse. And I just type in vinyl. 
and you want to go down to the printable here printable vinyl okay done and then it'll say printable vinyl here okay and there's no need to press more or less or anything you can just use the default setting And then this is what you'll come up with. Okay, and I don't know if you could see that, the cut. Okay, and again, I'm gonna use this for a base on a centerpiece.